Easter, it's right around the corner. And if you are looking for that last minute Easter brunch dish, I have the perfect one for you. My eggs in a basket. My baskets are actually gonna be my dinner rolls. And you wanna make sure that you get something that's nice and sturdy because you don't want your egg mixture to seep out. I've lined my sheet pan with some foil because I don't want my baskets to roll all around or roll all over the place. I want them to stay, stay put, don't go anywhere. And the foil helps with that. So now I'm going to butter my dinner rolls. And this is just butter that's at room temperature. So it makes it really nice and easy to just rub on. There we go. Butter just makes everything so much better. <laughs> I've cored my dinner rolls and the leftover bread, I'm gonna use it for breadcrumbs. The butter also helps the bread from absorbing all of the egg. It's kind of like a nice little barrier there. Also adding lots of flavor. Now onto my egg mixture. And you know, one thing that I love about this recipe is you're not using loads of ingredients and they're ingredients that you would probably already have in your pantry or in your refrigerator. Okay, so I have my eggs in a mixing bowl, and to that I'm gonna add some cooked bacon. Who doesn't love eggs and bacon? I'm gonna add some cheese, and we all know how I feel about cheese. <laughs> so good. I'm gonna add some milk, some salt, pepper, and some chives. Look at that. And I'm just gonna give it a whisk your eggs, your bacon, your cheese, your chives. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pour my egg mixture into my baskets, my dinner rolls. And just to make it easier, I'm gonna put it in a pitcher. Just gonna pour that in there. There we go. And this is why I call it my eggs in a basket. I'm gonna pour my eggs into my dinner rolls. Yes. You wanna make sure that you don't fill this all the way up to the top. Just kind of like right there. Awesome. Look at that. Yummy. There we go. I'm gonna add foil on top. Kind of like creating a tent. We're gonna bake this at 350 degrees for 30 minutes, then remove the foil and bake for another five minutes. Turn over the tops so that they get toasted as well. So my eggs in a basket are done. I'm just gonna just grab one, the biggest one. <laughs> I'm gonna add some chives on top. There we go. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Oh, look at that. Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Did I say I have the, like, the best job in my entire life? This is why I love to cook. This is so incredibly flavorful. The bacon and the cheese, with the egg and the chives, it's easy. I think you'll wow your family, your guests with this one. Brunch is huge in my house. This is what we serve. I want to know what you guys serve for brunch. And make sure you subscribe. I'll see you next week. Bye.